what's going on everybody welcome back to the channel today we're going to go over the easiest way to make coins in madden 22 right now now the prices with the new zero chill release are skyrocketed a lot of the 93 overalls that were down to about 128 129 130 thousand coins are now back over 150 thousand coins that's a 20k profit drop a like on the video for more madden 22 coin making methods and defensive and offensive tips let's get into the breakdown let's go this is your one stop shop for all Madden needs. Whether you're looking for some fly merchandise, you're looking for ebooks, you're looking for a Patreon membership, or you just want to become part of the Tutty Squad. I appreciate all the love and support. Everything is in the link in the description. Let's get it. All right, so starting the video off, they do have a new offer in the store. Lots of presents for $30. Whether it's a good deal or whether it's a bad deal is all up to you. I already have a few extra large presents, but with this lots of presents, you get one extra large guarantee. I don't know if it's going to be a jolly extra large or a regular extra large. And then you get two large presents and two medium presents. I'm not going to get it, but if you have $30 that you want to spend on the game to get presents, go ahead and take advantage of this right here. Now, I got rid of all my large presents and my medium presents because they were under a 93 overall quick sale. They were like 80,000 snow. A 93 overall is about 112,000, 115,000 snow, somewhere around that. So I knew that the present wasn't gonna contain anything real good, but the presents that are 144, thousand snow and higher lets me know that it would be higher than a 93 overall so that is worth it the method that you want to do is if you've been saving up any kind of low elites or if you've been sniping cards before today like i told you i told you on the last reroll snipe as many prices later on at night or early in the morning now you can go in and do the training reroll if we was to just go quick sell a couple random cards that we have get 3,000 training right there, got 4,000 total. Now, when we go look at these cards that I've been saving, I'm still waiting on the prices of the 83s to go up, but the 87s, I think, are back over 17K. Okay, so 15K, 17K, so they're around 17K. Once again, the market had went down a little bit later on yesterday, but now that the new releases came out, they are back up. So these 93 overalls that I pulled for free from the Cam Newton are between 144 and 150,000 coins. They were all the way down to about 128, 132,000 yesterday. So that's another 14 to 17,000 profit on every big pull that you get. Let's go look at the 91s. The 89s and the 91s is a lot of cards that you might pull to 88, 89 and see if the price has changed any. So we're gonna go 88, 89, we're gonna go zero chill, so 33,000 right there. Let's go to zero chill, and let's see if they went up. So 30,000, so he stayed around the same, and 91s, let me see. So 91s, 64, 65, 68. So the 91s, including the new ones, did go up in price because the 91 Nick Folk was like 56, 57, 58,000. The Garoppolo was around the same thing. So you are getting about an 8,000 coin increase on every pool that you get. So if you got any spare elites or anything, go in there, roll them, get yourself some free coins. It's an easy way for you to make a quick 50,000 to 200,000 coins. So if we went right here to training, 900 per roll these roll a couple of them real quick free training elites that you already have in your binder or some snipes you start off with a newer card that's an 85 overall ed oliver so if you were to look at him he's probably about six seven k so seven k each card right there the 83s were up to about twelve thousand. so that's free seven thousand that you can get off of that card right there hoping that you have the potential to pull something bigger. So I can roll my 6,000 snowflakes. I can roll my training. It's best for you to have at least 25K training. So there's an 83 overall. And then another good thing about this is any low card, so 6,500 to 7,000 free coins right there. 
All right, so looking at my binder, cards that I already had, wasn't doing anything with, is gonna turn into a quick profit. Now, if I was you, I would try to have about 20 to 25,000 training. I don't want you to spend your coins. I want you to find a way to either exchange cards and make the training, or if you are a sniper and you've been sniping cards for low, you can do that also. So with this little amount of only 3000 training, we get 16K right there, probably 17K total. And then we can go to this 85, we're gonna get another 7K. So looking at this 87, this 87, which are about 15 to 17,000 a piece, both of these are six to 7,000. Then we have this 87. So all total in that little sample size, we got about 65 to 70 K coins with 3,000 training. So if you were to snipe some cards, if you were to go ahead and start off with about 20 to 25, thousand training especially if you pull anything higher than the 87 if you pull the 89s that's going to be 30k that's going to be an easy 100 to 150 thousand coins that you can make if you pull a 93 that's already 160 thousand coins that you can make easy ways to make a lot of coins make sure that you take advantage of it go ahead you should have pre-sniped some cards if not make some sets so you can get some 83 84 overalls cash them out for training go ahead and roll the training or if you have extra snowflakes it's eight thousand per roll roll the extra snowflakes and get yourself some free coins take advantage of it because over the next four to five hours they might start dipping down in price right now with the new sets out you can take advantage of it but in the next four to five hours they will slowly the 93s will probably go from 160 162 down to about 140 142 that's a 20 thousand coin difference as you can see instantly my coin count already went up to 326 i sell this one it's gonna be about 450 475 and then i still have all these extra free cards this is another 16,000. this is another 16,000. another 7,000. then we have another 16,000. so that's a half of million coins all I did was the free Cam Newton, grinding the solos, sniping cards from off of the profit that I have, spend another 40, 50,000, and then put that back into your overall coin stock. So all total, I started off with about 120,000 coins. I turned that into what you see right now, about 460, 475,000 coins once the next one sell. And then we have all these extra free coins, another 60, 70,000 on top of it. I can do it all over again. I can open some, uh, get a player packs, do your daily missions, get some XP, get some more free packs, rinse and repeat. Drop a like on the video, hit that red subscribe button. No, for real, hit the red subscribe button and your notification button and become part of the fam. Cuddy Squad, stand up. I'll see y'all again in 24 hours.